hey guys welcome back to double payment manager we are back with another registration add-on video and today's topic will be how to add a registration from the back end or in the front end so if we need to add a registration from the back end that's pretty straightforward and simple let me show you how for that we need to go to event registration then we can even go to all event registration and add new from here or otherwise we can click this add new button as well so here firstly we need to type in our attendee name then we do not need to type this description as this is an attendee and then we have to type in our attendees email address and then we have to select an event under this event listing id so as we have a single event available as of now for this demonstration it's showing the single event over here if we had like multiple event listed for this demonstration we would see like uh, more options over here to select from so i'm selecting this event listing id as well as of now so then we can add custom field for this attendee from this custom field section so we have a lot of select options from here we can choose from and then enter a value and we can add like multiple custom fields as well and we can even add registration nodes over here we can even define the status for this registration from this panel as well so i'm leaving all them to default and if we click save we will see our event registration has been updated so if we go back to our dashboard and we have our newly registered uh, user over here in our attendee list so this is how simple it is to add a new registration from our backend side and frontend side even registrations are more simple let me show you how that's for we need to go to the front end first then if we go to our listing page and select a listing we have so in here if we scroll down a little bit so here we have a register for event button and here we have the registration form so if we click the same registration button so it will register us for the event so this is how we add a registration from the front end at back end we were able to add custom field but in front end that's not explicitly available but we can always customize add delete or modify this form fields over here we can even add a custom field down here as well we have a dedicated video regarding that feel free to check that out for more guidance so if we click send registration now it says your event registration has been submitted successfully so let us go back to the dashboard then if we check our attend list so we have another newly registered user over here as well so that's pretty much wraps it up for this very short video I I hope you enjoyed watching it and found it useful. If you did, a like to the video will be amazing. And if you are liking this series so far, a sub to the channel would be more amazing. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.